Hey, 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 at it again. I haven't seen much videos on how to tune this or how to update the firmware, where you would go to do that and, 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 and. So simple. You obviously get this guy and you get a little micro SD with a SD adapter so you can throw it into your laptop over here. And I'm getting the firmware for this, sorry for the dirt and stuff on here, but it's for the BLRPX3 is what I need the firmware for so I can use this guy to tune it. Okay, so that's the link you wanna go to teamyokomo.com right backslash parts backslash bl dash r 26 p 3 backslash you would obviously it'll start on this page here there's my tuning card or program card or whatever you want to call it and you'll roll all the way down oops and you'll go to this link right here bump and then there's the firmware update download this firmware and then all you would do is go onto your pc and go in go into a little downloads and then find that firmware there you'll stab this guy into your computer or laptop and then obviously just drag and drop it into that dude. Then you take this dude, right? And you'll stab it in here. So yeah, you would put the SD card in there and then take your cable, plug it into your ESC, which BLX-RPXS not three sorry i made a mistake earlier and then grab your radio might as well switch it on right plug in your power those are one up racing if you want to have some fancy and easy way to pull your stuff out one up racing positive i didn't put a negative on because i hardly remove the negative except for charging Anyway, switch her on, right? Sorry for the glare, boys. You would have this guy here. Holy glare life. Enter link ESC, of course. Here we go. Recognizes it. Now, Here's my pet peeve with this program box. We used to have the, oh, let me scratch around here. Sorry, I've got so many tuners. Collection, big collection of tuners. That's a gyro, so it's not that dude. Where is my Wi-Fi module? <laughs> anyway, you used to have the Yokomo uh, Wi-Fi module and you would throw it in there and then tune it via an app. Now, you've got this program card. This program card and ESC is now made by Hobbywing. Same box, same buttons, same plugs. A spare one here. Sorry, spare one here. No. Anyway, that's obviously a new plug, so you can link to this. And now it's got an SD card reader on this one, where this one never had it. Anyway, old box. There's the Yokomo. Wi-Fi link, which now does not work with the new ESCs. So, lame. 
And if you go into A, you have to go all the way back out to get back to this menu where you now can select. See, if I push up, it goes to Bravo, which is now brake settings and Charlie for boost, Delta for general settings, E for limit value, F for load settings. If you want to save your settings and share it with a buddy, it'll save it to the SD. You could throw it online or, or you know, somehow send it to him. Firmware update, obviously, is the first thing you want to do. You'll hit enter. It'll update the new firmware from here to here so that you can now adjust the parameters within this new ASC. Anyway. But now I can't dial back to A. I have to dial back all the way to A. So I'll go in here, power settings. So that's just your frequency. Oops. Sorry, one hand operation going on. So now you can adjust the frequency. And then enter it. If you hit enter again, <coughs> succeed. So now I've put that in here. Okay, great. Hit enter. Oh, no. Okay, so back to that. Oh, come on. To go to punch level, I'm gonna actually remove some punch out of mine. I don't like it. I'll go to eight, hit enter, enter again, and it's happy. Okay. So now, dial. Oh, come on. See, you're ready. Level two. Punch. Compress. Throttle level. Reverse force. And then back to frequency. Okay, sweet. So, yeah. It's kind of annoying. I don't like it. You have to go into something and then so on and so forth and so on and so forth. Now, the only way I know, I don't know, it's just kind of silly. I think it's, you know, okay, sure, Hobbywing is an amazing company, don't get me wrong. They make great stuff, but <clears throat> Yokomo could have put more input into this situation here where they could have kept this into a Wi-Fi mode and you could have downloaded the new firmware via Wi-Fi onto your app and then downloaded it onto your ESC in that way. So, yeah, awesome ESC. M micro, micro size. It's so freaking small. You know, but still, they could have done better. Anyway, that's my five cents. Uh, now, I'll switch this on again. Yes, I do want to go in there. Okay, sure. Now, that's power settings. Brake settings. Drag brake off, obviously. I'm not racing, I'm drifting. Oh, and I just messed with it. Now I hit select. Brake punch level. Initial brake. Frequency. Maximum. And so on. Now for some reason I can't remember how to go back to the next thing to adjust which is the Charlie so I'll switch it off I'm obviously too stupid to remember how to do certain things but so what you get the idea though it's you know oh come on Afro no so there's my boost I'm definitely going to mess with my boost. So activation via RPM. 
Eh, I don't know if I like that. Oh, and I just... Why, well, I see, it's just... Why? Automatically for RPM. So why don't they have... Yeah. Anyway. How much boost do I want? I'm going to crank it up. Just because I can. And I'll say 60. Okay. Boost starts at... Hmm. Let's make a low, but so what? Anyway. And then the 60,000 is where I'll stop, which that's my max. How much timing? Sure, I'll add it to <coughs> 44 just because I can. <coughs> see now, see how it starts back at one? Why? Why do I have to go all the way through this again? Turbo starts at 95%, which is my throttle percentage. How much pull I've put on the throttle. How much delay. How much uprake per 0.5 seconds. It's 30 degrees uprake. So that, imagine drawing a curve is what this is doing right now. And then my down right, right? Coming off the accelerator, do I still have some boost in there or not? Anyway, now back at one. So now, I don't know how to go back to the previous menu. So, off, back on, hit enter, hit enter again, back to alpha. Oh my God, see? Because you were changing it here previously, now I gotta change it here. And I can't go all the way through to the other end. Oh, and now my radio is getting very annoyed. Anyway, so brake, boost, general settings, limit values. Let's go into that. Minimum voltage. I think is what that says. So I need to change this actually. And I can't go lower. Uh, and I could be wrong. Don't get me wrong. I could be totally wrong. So, oh. How did I jump back? Anyway. General. Boost. Brake. And, oh, I went up the wrong way. Anyway. So, you, you get what I'm saying. It's, it's kind of annoying. They could have done this better and so forth and so on. But, you know, who am I? Anyway, guys, I hope you guys are having a good time. And hopefully someone enjoys this video and it helps them. I don't know. Anyway, peace.